Welcome to our virtual home show. This is Slacker from 101 The Fox. I'm happy to have you join me. Grab your bag. We may pick up some pens and magnets. We're going to stop along the way with all the great vendors. We're going to stop and see my friends at Window Nation. My friend Harley is up here. First of all, I see him. Harley, welcome. How you doing? Brother, I am great. I am uh, I'm, I'm excited. We've got the virtual home show. And as we mentioned, you know, we've got a great deal that's going on. We're going to talk about that. But, you know, this is a great opportunity for everybody to take a look at some of the things that we've been talking about for quite a while. And, you know, as we just have pretty much gotten through the winter, we're heading into spring here in Kansas City, and that comes with all kinds of things. People like to open up their windows and let a little fresh air in. But as they've been shut most of the winter, you might find that some of those windows don't open properly. And and you mentioned before we went on today that it's kind of what you suggest as a, a spring cleaning is take a look at your windows. Tell us about that. Yeah, I mean, as soon as the weather breaks, you know, what you'll typically find is people going around and uh, cleaning, cleaning the yard up, cleaning the garage up, opening their windows to get some ventilation before they put that AC on, right, that, that bridge between too hot and too cold. And we recommend, you know, go around and open all your windows, see if they open properly, right? You don't want them slamming down like a guillotine. You don't you don't want them not being able to open and clean them uh, or if you can clean them at all. Plus, if you see any cracks or damages around the inside or outside, now is really the best time to catch that before it might cause serious damage around, around the actual wall itself. Our friend Harley from Window Nation joining us today. And, you know, one of the things that I found before I got my Window Nation windows was that the old vinyl windows that were in some parts of the house, they they weren't particularly old, maybe eight, nine years old, but they were already warped and buckled. They we couldn't even we couldn't even fully close one of the windows. Fortunately, it was on the second floor, so I didn't feel terribly bad about it at the moment at the time we bought the house. But that's the problem. You you can't you these these old windows, even if they're 10 plus years old. It's almost time to replace them because here in Kansas City, and I'm sure just about all parts of the country is this way, we have extreme cold. We had, you know, three weeks ago, we had 15 below zero. And the other day we had 80 degrees. So it's incredibly, you know, constant changing. And that plays havoc on the window. Yeah, there's really two reasons, right? One, it was it could have been improperly installed, which happens a lot. If these windows aren't measured correctly, we measure our windows down to the eighth of an inch. Um, you know, a lot of homes, especially ones that are 40, 50 years old, the windows, the openings are out of square. So you got to square up those openings. And it's, it's not just a matter of taking an old window out, putting a new window in. You, you got to make sure that the opening is prepped properly first, or you're going to have those kinds of problems. Vinyl expands and contracts. And if you don't allow it to do that, it's going to warp. Um, but there's also different generations of vinyl and reinforcements in the window itself. So the larger the window, you know, you're going to need some kind of reinforcement. And uh, we use a composite reinforcement, a non-metal reinforcement, um, which is important because in the cold, you don't want that conducting to the inside. Sure. Um, but yeah, there's a, a lot of reasons why that might be the case. And, you know, we, we, we like to come out, give an assessment and let people know whether they should get their windows replaced now, whether they have still time left, whether there's just a couple windows they want to replace. Um, a lot of different options. You know, one of the great things about the installers that I talked to that were here these guys, this, this wasn't their first rodeo. In fact, two of the guys had been here for almost 18 years. They had a great deal of experience. And it wasn't, as you mentioned, just taking the old window out and putting the new window in. They made sure that everything was perfect. They had insulated. I had a couple of the windows had the old um, weights. They pulled those out and, and got all of that area that was a cavity insulated so that they, when they replaced the window, everything was nice and sealed up and very energy efficient. So it's not like replacing an HVAC system, right? There's nine, 10 different ways, different types of in window installations. You could take out a wood window, a vinyl replacement, a vinyl new construction, aluminum, a metal. There's so many different ways and types. It's, it's not like a one size fits all. Um, yeah, our window installers, that's all they do is windows. Day in and day out, five days a week, they're installing just windows because it's a specialized trade. And it's not easy. It's not like they go and deal with the same situation time after time. There is no question. Um, it's a very challenging process, especially for some of the uh, the newer kinds of windows we take out, like aluminum and, and vinyl construction. 
You know, one of the things that was, you know, I had a concern initially until I saw the amazing selection that you have was because my home is 110 years old. I wanted windows that would be uh, architecturally reminiscent to the homes that were in my neighborhood around. And that included the dividers, which I was able to get. And now it looks as though I've got I've got all of the energy efficiency of the 21st century with the look of the you know 20th century. And they're amazing. And I, I highly recommend that people take advantage right now. You guys have a great deal going on, the virtual home show do, deal. And to just set that appointment, give them a call and find out what you're looking for. Whether it's replacing a few windows or, as we did, the entire house, you need to give them a call and let them know. Uh, set that appointment, 866-90-NATION, or visit them online at windownation.com, of course. Tell them you're a slacker backer. You get a great deal. And, you know, this during this virtual home show tour, you take us a little bit back there with some of your displays because there is all kinds of different energy efficient windows from Window Nation. Yeah. So you can actually go to windownation.com backslash home show. We have videos. We have design ideas. Um, you can get a chance to take a look at, at, at windows like I have here in our in our actual showroom. Um, and explore what's different. May it be a, you know, a garden window like, like this right here, which is a nice window you put up uh, uh, over your kitchen sink. Or we have bays and bows. We got we got sliding doors, entry doors. So quite a, a lot of different things to choose from. And that's definitely one thing that separates us from a lot of our competition is we custom make everything, and we have so many different options. If you want for instance furniture sometimes people like the distressed look some people like the modern look you know we can offer things like to accommodate a home that's a century home is totally different than putting windows in a home that was built 20 years ago colonial right um so all the different options are available we can customize we can do custom colors we can do paint to sample colors um really it's it's limitless we'll pick up that phone and give them a call at 866-90-NATION our friend harley from Window Nation joining us. And brother, it is always a pleasure to chat with you and take advantage of the great deals and get those new energy efficient windows from Window Nation, always the perfect fit. Tell Aaron I said, hello, buddy. Will do, Slacker. Hey, appreciate the time and we uh, we look forward to seeing you soon.